All right, guys, welcome back to more Days Gone. Man, we're so far into this game, but I feel like we still have a lot left. I uh, really thank you so much for all the likes, all the support, every every upload. Uh, I know probably some of you don't watch these videos till later when you have time. So just, you know, it really means a lot to me, all the support each and every day. So I love you guys. Let's get this. All right, nice. Kind of want to rest till daytime as well. I feel like what I'll wind up doing is after I finish the game, if the support for the series is still like going strong, and it still has been, it's been, I mean, incredible. So thank you guys for being a part of this. I don't trust this guy on the right with my bike. He always knocks it over. Hey, Zanny, keeping your hands clean. Can I help you? Let me put this on the map for her. Deke, we got a real problem on our hands. You remember Richard Marsden used to ride for us? Oh, you mean Rick the Prick Marsden? Yeah, I remember him. I thought Al Kai ran him out of camp. He did, but oh, I guess Marsden wasn't too happy about it. He joined a group of drifters down at the Black Crater, led an attack against a supply run. We lost three men. Oh, shit, I never liked that son of a bitch anyway. I'll take care of him. Oh, thanks, Deke. I knew I could count on you. All right, put that on the map at least. Um, let me go over here, buy some ammo, and then I'll uh, sleep till morning. Cause I hate the nighttime in this game when like I'm trying to drive around, cause it's it's kind of hard to see, see sometimes. Okay. He's on my monitor. It is. Something? One cent. Can I get anything else for you? I'm good on all that. Let me buy this. Need I didn't think I'd need else? med kits, but good choice. But like just just a little bit ago, I was getting. Destroyed and uh, all right. I've already bought all these. Find good. me if you need anything else. I right, let's go I'm sleep it up really quick. I don't know why, but I was uh, I actually went and looked at the soundtrack for this game. That's one thing I haven't been able to do. You guys probably haven't noticed it, but there's no music when I play. I had to turn it off, otherwise my videos get good. taken down. Some uh, but the soundtrack I went and bought it. It's so good. It is so good. I was ready to go back at it. <clears throat> There was a song called Hell or High Water on the soundtrack. I forgot the guy's name that performs it, but I went and listened to it, and I was like, it really kind of fits the overall theme of this game, you know? It's just, it's a really good song. But yeah, the way YouTube is now, like, I can't have volume. I, I, I can have everything uh, normal, but I just, if I put music, <laughs> it just gets taken down for some reason. So it is what it is. Hey, a deacon, right? All right, refuel. How's the bike business going, Zanny? Repair. See ya. <laughs> See ya. All right, I think we're good. Let's go visit our tombstone, and then I think after that we have the other part. We got to go actually talk to O'Brien. Uh, uh, I'm gonna get all these camps up to 100%. I want to get them all to like the last level by all the weapons, do the horde stuff, do all these side missions where I'm getting the infestations. Uh, so I'll kind of leave it up to you guys how much of that I do after I do finish the main story. I don't know how many more parts we have left. I'm going to guess the series will end somewhere in the 50s. But I really don't know. That's just me speculating. Is that a thing back there I could have burned? Or was that one I already had burned? I don't know. I think it was one I already burned. Oh, man. Watch out. I don't know why this game wants, like, I, I don't know if I'm supposed to ride a motorcycle, but I kind of want one after playing this game, you know? Hopefully you guys stay with me. I've, this is my guess. Somebody actually asked what I think about... Uh, let me go ahead and top off since I know that can. on the way out I might be chased by zombies. I want to go ahead and kind of just be ready. And I'm also going to park it facing the other way. <laughs> Hold on. That way, if I hop on it, I don't have to backpedal. Let's do this. All right, there we go. Let me quick save it. You never know what's lurking around the corner in this game. All right, so somebody asked me what I think is going to be the next big game uh, as far as, like, the Sony titles go. So I was thinking about it, and... I saw a comment on Reddit that actually made a lot of sense. I don't know who it was from, but it, they said that their their expectation is that this is, you know, the early year release, Days Gone. 
And then, maybe this fall we're gonna get The Last of Us 2. Or The Last of Us Part 2 is what they call it. Uh, and then... This time next year... We'll probably get that ghost game, the Samurai I don't know what it's called, but it's like Ghost of something. Uh, and then we'll probably get... I don't know. I, I'm not sure. I don't know when the PlayStation 5 is going to come out. I'm going to guess it's next fall. I guarantee... I, I don't know, man. 2013 was a long time ago, so... I feel like it's overdue. I can't believe I was... <laughs> I remember I... I mean, I was still kind of up and coming when that thing came out, so... That's just, I don't know. We've come a long way. Uh, hey. Me again. I know. I know. It's uh, been a while since I've been up here. It's just, um... Whew. Okay, we, uh, had a run-in with the Rippers. Uh, with Carlos. See, um... Turns out, Carlos is actually this two-bit hood we knew from before. Back in the day, he was a fully patched member of the MC. Yeah, I know. What are the odds of him surviving? Jesse goddamn Williamson when so many others died. And uh, I never told you what happened to Jesse. Uh, well, you know, because you hate it when I talk about club shit. So let's just say that some bad shit went down. Really bad shit. And Jack, he, uh, he, well, he kicked Jesse out of the club, but you can't take your colors with you. See, that, that's a problem. So, problem is Jesse had a mongrel's tat on his back, just like mine, you know? So, yeah, me and Boozer, Jersey Jim, we held him down while Jack, uh, took a welding torch to, uh, to his back. Look, I'm not proud of it. I'm not proud of it. I, I never told you because... Because um, I knew that you would never be with someone who could do something like that. And, uh, hey, you know, I would tell you that I've changed. But at this point, there's, there's no reason to lie to you anymore. I killed him. Jesse. I had to. I mean... Guy was a goddamn psychopath. But, uh, we didn't stop with him. Boozer and I, we, we blew him up. The Rippers, we blew up their camp. We drowned them like a bunch of sorry rats. And you know what? I'm not sorry. I just thought you should know. Okay. <laughs> I gotta go. Uh, I'll, I'll talk to you later. <laughs> All right, 74%. Man, we're cruising through that why am I here story job. Uh, Meet O'Brien. Oh, yeah, that's the same one we were going to do. I just realized there's gas cans all over this area. Well, not gas cans, but there's uh, explosive barrel. You would think you'd be getting, getting like, ambushed by a horde every time you come here or something. So we we're still going to visit her tombstone, even though that Deacon believes that she's alive. For us to still go back to her memorial. I don't know, it's just, it seems off. Like, I wonder what's gonna happen with this whole storyline. I like how there's a mixture, though. You got the Ricky and the Iron Mike storyline. You got the Boozer storyline. You had the Schizo one. Uh, which, that kind of had a screeching halt. <laughs> and then you had a few of the side things from Copeland's camp area. And then, I don't know why I'm going this way. This is actually a good little entrance. Hold on. Oh, it does. Nice. I'm actually going to restart my footage. I don't know if it's the end of the video. It probably isn't. I mean, it could, it could be. I don't know. I don't want to make any assumptions. All right, guys. Give me one second. All right, guys. Sorry for the weird cut. We're actually 811 days gone, by the way. Kind of cool. <laughs> All right, let's get going. I always restart my footage. I always set like a mini break. So when I come back, I'm always like disoriented. I just forgot what I was saying earlier about how I think when the PlayStation 5 drops, I feel like... Don't hold me to it, but I feel like uh, Death Stranding might be oh, great. the pair right there. Hey, buddy. He's just chilling. He ain't gonna hurt nobody. Oh, there's a sni- oh my- there's a sniper next to me. Yo, there's a research site right here. Wait a minute. Oh, looks like- please don't hit me. Oh. How do I get up there? 
Do I go through the cave right here next to me, or do I go up around? I think I gotta go up around. Yo, I'm about to get that stamina or I think I'll get a health buff. Please tell me it's an easy... I, yeah, it's gotta be under. Yo, hold on. I think it's through this cave down here. Is that a... They just came out of that cave, guys. Oh my goodness. Yeah, we're not going there. Well, I wanted to go there. That is insane. See ya. How am I gonna drive? Hold on. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Storyline bounty hunter. Oh yeah, I think if I just go and... You just gotta kill the person, get the thing, and then I can- yeah, I can just do that along the way. That's perfect. Yo, check out the, uh... Little, uh, fire we got going on here. I wanted to say thank you guys for, I mean, even watching this right now, like... At, when I have this long of a game that I'm playing, uh, it's always exciting knowing that, hey, you guys are... 100% committed, you know, like if you're watching part 40 plus that means you're you know, you're a part of this So thank you for making this series of a pretty big hit for the year Marston, where the hell are you? It's up there I can go up here and take him out or should I take my bike? Yeah, I kind of want to I could just drift down the hill if I need to We'll go up here right before we go and talk to O'Brien uh, You're out here somewhere Tucker, I'm here. Your I man see Marsden me. looks all good. Like he got himself a goddamn army. <laughs> Doesn't surprise me. He always seemed like the kind of man who'd attract every dirtbag out in the shit. Want me to send Alki? What was he wearing when your man got hit? Same thing he always wore. One of those black boots <laughs> down to the knees. Cowboy hat. <laughs> Deke, bring me his hat. More holes in it the better. Okay, so he's stressed like an asshole. Got it, St. John out. Where did my sniper go? I must have Get not, uh... That's a stool leg. wonder what you can make with a stool leg. Well, I got no sniper, so... I gotta go down the hill. Um... Alright, what do we do here, guys? What do we do? Uh, let's just go for it. I've already killed the guy, so I really don't need to take out everybody. She's been shot! like this, you just got it. We're out of here. Oh, no, no! Oh, shit, what the? Where'd, boys come from? Where'd that person come from? Come on, we gotta go, we gotta go. Easy up. <laughs> All right, we're good. I hope I got it. I kind of just ran right when I grabbed that item. Now I can just go talk to the person later on. Whoever it was found up is for Tucker or Copeland. I can't remember, but oh, that was stressful. I got to get my weapon back. I still Brian mission better just be like a hey, go spy on some of the Nero site stuff. No, 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 oh, sniper. No guns. Oh no, another sniper. I gotta run for it. Kinda took a leap of faith there, didn't I? Ooh, game's lagging just a little bit. There's a memorial thing over there I can go get. I'll, I'm gonna do a lot of that smaller stuff after I beat the game. Uh, infestations, I'll kinda mix in as I go. The bounty hunter stuff as well. Uh, oh, I need gas. Infected wolves! Ah! All right, come on. Oh, here we go. Yeah, I'm just good. man. I every time I get the chance to play this game, I'm just excited because it's a uh, it's a different kind of game. I think it's it's honestly a, a really underrated game at this point, and I'm 
I'm just happy that you guys seem to also think so by watching this and wanting more of the game that, you know, it means it's a good game, you know? Uh, question mark over this, just forget it. Getting through here, hopefully isn't too bad. Sometimes the light auto turns on, other times it doesn't even click. You gotta do it yourself. Oh my goodness. Oh, what the oh, damn it, ambush, ambush. Oh, it's ambush. I think I was just speeding past it. Oh, no, hang on, that body on the ground I ran over, I think they were supposed to be like a dummy. That's funny. I guess they got what they deserve. Oh yeah, I got a skill point a while back. I need to use this thing. All right, um, somebody told me under the focus area, iron grip, no, that wasn't it. Under pressure, reload times, accuracy. I remember it was the melee stuff. I wanted just to see what all we got. Yeah, I like this. I think the reckoning, if you think about it, that basically would mean that any time I'm swinging a weapon, you can get a prompt. Now, sometimes I'll see it anyways. But I think it might pop up more now. Or just maybe... Just more and more often, I guess. Oh, right, where do we gotta go? Oh, we're right next to it. Nice. So, meeting O'Brien here. Or that's the coordinates he sent. I'm gonna guess he's gonna be there. Uh, last time we... I guess we saw the storyline about her having her key card. Or the, I, the ID card to get into that facility. So she had clearance. So then he was trying to remember about like flashback with the clearance. And then he called O'Brien and uh... I don't know. The storyline's been really good. I feel like we're near the end of the game though. Everything's at like 70 to 80%. I would imagine... I don't know what... When would it actually be the end? You know? You beat the game and then it's... I've heard you get the horde mode, uh, not the horde mode, but like the horde missions, I guess? I don't know if that's true or not. Alright, here's the helicopter. So what the hell? I managed to recruit a few guys who I trust, but like me, aren't happy with what's going on. So why am I here? I wanted to give you this. You were right. About your wife. How did you get this? When Silver Lake evacuated, they took Nilo personnel, federal officials, and well... Sarah Irene Whitaker had a class four federal clearance level. Clearance level. The wife bugged out with a recon unit east of Fort Rock. Take me there. No. No. Well, you got a ride. We're all friends now. The base is gone. What? A year ago. Local militia group. Militia group? Where's their camp? We don't know. How the hell can you not know? You got a helicopter. You got satellites. Somewhere around Crater Lake, but it's a no-fly zone, okay? They got outposts, rockets, RPGs. Crater Lake. Crater Lake. Oh, I wanted to tell you about the work we're doing. Studying the infected, the freaks. They're evolving. As bad as things are right now, they're gonna get worse. A lot worse. I like that. All right, 78% done. Nice. Finding Nero is also kind of getting there. All right, riding Nomad again. What is this for? Is this for the... Oh, surviving isn't living. Uh, we've all done things. I think I can just fast travel there. I think I'm just going to do that. Kind of keep things moving. All right, I'm going to get my sniper back. I don't know what point I... Swapped it or dropped it or something. I don't know what happened, you know? This is Radio Open Free Organ. The yeah. truth shall set you free. It has come to my attention that some of you are out there working with Nero. Last day. The very same Nero we saw cut down a group of survivors not too long ago. The same Nero that abandoned us here in this shit two years past. Some 
call these people fools. But I got a better name for them. Traitors. And I assure you, I don't take treason lightly. But I am a reasonable man. So you get one warning. Listen up. Stop what you're doing. Now. Before we find you. Because we will. And when we do, I you stick around to see what happened to him. Pay. I'll personally string like you said, up on the biggest tree I find. And while you're breathing your last, we'll quarter you and feed you to the freaks you love. That is a promise. This is Mark Copeland for Radio Free Oregon. Don't believe the lies. Yeah, well, Cope, I gotta say I don't like it any more than you. Do your worst. Wanted to put that on there, and I didn't want the deep, merchant and them deep, over talking deep. each other because sometimes What's that can kind of be annoying. Away so long? Hey, Blair, how are things in the gun trade? I'm gonna buy this as well. We offer a 30 day money back guarantee, so as long as you never bring it back. Um, I'm gonna put this gun back on because pistols are amazing in this game. Uh, good choice. Let me, uh, let me also get, yeah, the suppressor. Yep, that's nice. Refill yeah, assault rifle good. ammo. I think I'm good. Yep. All right, uh, I'm gonna just go over, head over stranger. here and I guess start with the next mission. Let me look at the active storylines we got. So we got, right now we got, I remember we can keep going through that. We got Riding Nomad again. Uh, with Boozer, f uh, Ride South to find Sarah, really? Hold on. Wouldn't these be, like, intertwined, I guess? Obviously these other things can wait, so. Yeah, let's do this first. I didn't know it really mattered. Finding Sarah versus the Iron River, maybe. Let's see what the old man's got to say. All right, here we go. I love all the stuff on his back. It just reminds me a lot of the division. It always has, too. Uh, wait, what? Advancing the story will I'll lock you out from the northern regions. Whoa, hold on. That's the first time I've seen that. Should we look at the I Remember storyline really quick first? Hold on. How far away is this? Oh, it's all the way back up there. Uh, only thing keeping me is- Should I go there first and then come back? Because I feel like I won't be able to do this. Because that's part of the north. I feel like I should go do that first. So now there is an order. So my guess is progressing that storyline will trigger the end of the game. And we'll kind of be locked into it. So anything I want to do now, I probably should do it first. So what I think I'll do is I need to get gas first. I'm going to fast travel here. Hold on, let's see what this says. Yeah, I think I gotta talk to them anyways. I can fast travel there, then fast travel here, and then go up there. Uh, one last visit to the tombstone, I'm guessing? I don't know. If there's multiple endings to the game, I kinda wonder how that all works out. Yeah, I'll come back here and do this. I just, I don't wanna... I would hate to miss something, I guess. Cause I feel like I can finish the I Remember storyline, but... This one's gonna lock me out from ever going there again. So I want to do this first, anyways. Deacon St. John, how you been? All right, refuel. How's it going, I got Russ? a bunch of money. Good, great. There. Good as new. All right, we're gonna do some fast traveling, hopping really quick. All right, we're gonna go here first. We're gonna just kind of make our way up there without actually having to drive too much, except for at the end. 